Girls, Kat here. Today I have a new bag to show you. It is my dream bag. I have been looking for the perfect, like, carry-all bag forever. I'm super picky about, like, what my bags have, and this bag is perfection. Let me just tell you. So, let's see it. Da -da -da. It's from Restyle. Um, I've seen their bags before and almost bought a few of their bags in the past. They have really good prices on their bags for how, like, design, intricately designed they are. I always feel like they're pretty decently priced, but I wasn't sure about the quality. I had, um, seen a few of them at Paradiso last year. Um, there was the, like, kind of henna bag that they have. I almost bought that one, and it was super nice quality there. It just didn't have enough pockets for me, so... I withheld from that but this one is amazing it has so many pockets and it has everything I need I've been kind of wanting a bag that you could wear like under your shoulder like this for a while but I'm the kind of person who always buys like crossbody style bags just they're never big enough for what I need so it's like well if I could get something kind of like this that also has a long strap it would be great and this one did come with a long strap and I actually wear it with the long strap the most um, I do like these, um, but they kind of get in the way every once in a while if you're wearing them with a long one. This one on the back can like rub against your leg weird, so I try to flip it over to the other side when I'm wearing it. It just pops back over a lot. <laughs> so I don't know, I might take off these straps because I don't know how often I'm going to wear it like this, but it is very comfortable to wear like this. I just really like crossbody bags, so of course I wear it with a big, <laughs> huge strap all the time. And they're both really nice quality. This feels like super well stuck to it. I don't know. I really like it. And I had to find it because it was sold out on the website and it was sold out on a bunch of other sites. I had to like find it on eBay from like a seller in Germany to buy it. <laughs> and that's how I ended up getting it. But um, I'm glad I did. Uh, one of the reasons I love it the most is because one of my biggest like um, pet peeves is when purses don't have pockets in the back. Or when they do, they have like... Um, zipper pockets that have like the metal zippers that cut your hands when you try to like reach into them And I like having a back pocket that's like in towards my body because that's where I keep my cell phone So I can slide it in and out like easily and just have it in easy access and not like in the bottom of my purse So this one has like the perfect cell phone shaped pocket. Look at let me get my cell phone I can put it bloop, right in there This is my new phone, so it doesn't have a cute case yet, but <laughs> It fits perfectly in there, and bonus points, I can keep my keys in there, so I'm not digging for my keys all the time, but that is amazing. So I use that pocket all the time. Then the front has a big, like, zipper pocket that's kind of, like, half moon shaped, and you open it up. I keep my business cards that I keep in this little, like, purse doohickey thing. Then my regular cards, like my credit card, insurance card, IDs, I keep in this like kind of stretchy wallet thing in the front. And perfume and lipstick because yeah, you always need that. And there's still plenty of room in this front pocket. Plenty, plenty of room for like if I need any extra makeup or want to keep anything else in here. Like say I don't want my cell phone, I'm going to be like riding a ride at Disneyland or something. I don't want my cell phone falling out, I can put my cell phone in this bigger zipper pocket so it can actually zip all the way. And these really cute moon charms, they're so adorable, I love these. They're perfect, they fit on it just so perfectly. And then to close it, it has like this little magnetic snap just to hold everything together. So when I was looking at it online, I didn't realize that the center section had a zipper, but it does. So. I like that that's zipped because I am i don't like buying the bigger purses like uh, under the shoulder purses like this tend to not have zippers and it freaks me out like anybody could just reach their hand inside your bag but um, this one has a zipper so I was pleasantly surprised when I got it because it was going to be kind of like oh that might make me uncomfortable I might only use it certain times but I needed a bag that was big enough to hold my camera this huge giant T5i and it can um, but it can also hold a lot more at the same time. It can also hold my Osmo, which only one of my purses so far and my backpack barely can handle holding the Osmo. can hold the Osmo in there. We've got more. My cell phone um, charger cable. Another charger cable, which is from my old cell phone, so I'm going to have to buy a new one, actually. Um, a power 
port, my car port, the extra battery for my Osmo, some alcohol wipes in case I need to wipe the lens on my camera, um, this little USB micro as USB connector that I use to transfer files off of my old phone, but my new phone has tons of space, so I don't know if I'll be able to use, need to use it, even if I can because it's the old USB and not USB-C. I don't know. I still have it. This is what I usually carry until I just got my new phone on Friday, <laughs> so I don't know. Um, a battery pack, a huge one. This can charge two phones at the same time. It's also a flashlight, and it has um, storage in it, I'm pretty sure. And it can charge like four times each of the phones. And then I got another one, the older version of it or the newer version. I don't know. They look exactly the same. So I have a lot. This is also really, really heavy, just so you guys know. I carry a lot of crap with me and my arms are always dying. And the base for the Osmo, which is also weighted so extra heavy. I have my grocery receipt in there. Yeah, that all. All of this fit in here, plus I can fit the camera, my extra bag that has all the extra camera batteries, camera SD cards that it's kind of like this but doubled in width. Um, and there's still plenty of space. Look, I can fit that my camera bag and my camera in there pretty, pretty well. There is um, a little like non-zipper pockets. Like, you know those classic makeup cell phone pockets that like every purse has that you're like, why do you have these? We don't have cell phones those shapes anymore. I don't understand the purpose of those pockets, but they're a classic thing that are in all purses still, as well as like there's a little restyle logo right here and a big zipper pocket inside as well, like another zipper pocket. There's so much organization in here. I love it. This is literally my dream purse. It's not like I wanted a goth purse that wasn't like super tacky, that was still kind of classy looking, but also big and in charge looking and can hold everything without being sacky. This is the purse for you. This is my dream purse. I'm literally everything in one thing that I like. It reminds me of a Sailor Moon with the moons, the little crescent moons. It reminds me that I love bats, you know, Hello Batty and all that stuff. I love bats, but it's not like super tacky batty. This is like literally the best purse in the whole world. <laughs> I'm just going to say that right now that I'm very happy with my purchase. Oh, this is the best bag ever. I can put so much stuff in it. But just if you guys wonder if I'm walking around looking like my arms are going to fall off, it's because this bag is heavy. Even without everything in it, it was pretty heavy, but I'm carrying a lot of stuff. I'm carrying the giant steady cam for my phone. I'm carrying the two battery packs for the phones and all of the like equipment for the camera. I don't know how often I'm actually going to be bringing this camera around with me lately because it's been acting up and my new phone has an amazing camera on it so I can use the Osmo and just vlog. But I'm still going to have the extra batteries for that because um, streaming and vlogging from my phone kills the battery. And I'll probably be bringing my extra phone around just in case like if I'm streaming and I want to watch chat I can use the other. Wait, I don't have data on that phone anymore because we were originally going to buy data for it. But I don't right now. But until I do, I might use it. Maybe I'll use it to record or take some pictures or things if I'm already using the other. You know what I mean. I'm going to keep both phones in this. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it holds up. I've already had it for a couple weeks now, and I have loved every single outing with it. I like that it's big so I can always find where it is. I like that it's well organized so I can just grab my keys and I'm not digging anymore. I still love my other purses, but this purse is the supreme queen of purses forever. I'm going to get married to this bag. This bag and me. We're soulmates forever. Anyways, I'll leave a link to it on the resale site, but like I said, the last time I checked it was sold out. I do know they restock their stuff quite often, so you could probably check back. Um, it was not sponsored, just letting you know I picked this out and bought it on a whim in the middle of the night myself. So, yeah, but I love it. <laughs> Anyways, I will see you guys soon. Don't forget to stay spooky and do all those things like like, subscribe, comment, send me shit on Instagram. All the links are down in the video description. I will see you again. Again, stay spooky. Spooky, spooky, spooky. Okay, anyways, I don't know what's going on. I just really love this person. I'm super high off of my love for this person. Bye.